Let's go. Thank you. La familia, la familia. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back to the Infinity Kingdom video with Senku from Survey 66. And today's video, guys, we're gonna do a recap from the previous video about uh, gnomes that I've got. And in this video, I'm gonna do a live, so I'm gonna spend about 200 and 400 gems just to swap talents. And we're gonna see, I didn't try it yet, but we're gonna see in real how it works and how good it is or how bad it is. Or we're gonna see if it's worth it or it doesn't worth it. All right, so today, guys, we have the uh, gnome hunt event going on. So we've been killing plenty gnomes. You guys know we all after this new gems equipment. All right, oops, we all have to this new gems equipment as you guys know we everybody everybody want them everybody is after them so let's see if this new talent or oh, if these talents for gnomes actually works or not okay so first thing first um the first thing first what you need in order to do this in the best way guys you need to have your gnome your gnome march all right when i when i mean you're killing gnome march basically i mean a march the First of all, you can gain experience from it, all right? As you can see, this is my no March, which I use this right now. This guy is, is just so good. You know, you need this guy. Even if you don't use it in your main marches, or even if you don't use it in any of your marches, you need to have Charles. Charles is just so good in order to make this work very nice, all right? Charles is just so good. And he doesn't need any special skill, really. As long as you go Fighting Master, um, wind rage and adrenaline rush is just good enough all right it's just good enough so i use uh, charles is max is fine and then i have these three immortals which are level 49 listen i didn't even work the uh, immortal level it's still in zero the boost is still in zero all right as you can see melin is zero and gcng is zero so anybody can do it okay i know i use kind of fancy skills but you can make it work with any normal skill as long as you have this skill on charles you can as long as you got these skills on charles and you use shelter and berserker is fine you don't need to have any of the other fancy skills that i've got that just make it more easy but you can use okay god different blessings rage blessings and those normal skills we just give you a good results as well all right i just use this skill because i've got them and they make the job way easier but you can use the normal skill and it will work you can use oaken guard you can get, use energy suppression you can use a uh, rage blazing you can use different skills so it will work all right you don't need to have immortals max the only thing i would recommend to put good artifacts decent artifacts at least uh and melin i don't even use artifact you know uh in gcng i use this one i could put a good artifacts and make it better but just too lazy to put the artifact the only thing i would recommend you as well is to put good equipment at least uh not zero put some equi equipment on them to make the difference and to make those immortals more uh, strong all right and make sure you have your uh, known mat ready because what you want because you're gonna be killing a lot of gnomes you want to storage some xp all right you want to storage XP because when the new update come and it's more to level 60 come, you want to uh, get that XP back in order to boost your main immortals. All right. So that's my uh, norm killing mod. As you can see, Charles, I use Leonidas, I use YCNG and I use Merlin. And the other thing you need to know, you need to pay attention to, you have to make sure that you have your main dragon um, kind of max because those stats from the dragon is actually gonna boost your immortals and it's gonna reduce a lot your death all right so when you got your no march ready your no killing march ready what you have to do is i will test it out as well so what we're gonna do we're gonna go into my normal uh, talent all right which is which it doesn't have anything related to a uh, known boost it's got everything normal so again back to it and then we gonna treat how much we get from it so let's put it this way i've got four thousand um let's put it more okay i've got a uh, four thousand nine hundred ap and if i do a rate okay uh, let's put it right i can get from this i can get 70 okay i can kill 70 it's gonna cost me four thousand nine hundred ap killing 70 gnomes all right and now what we're gonna do we're gonna go to the talent are we gonna set up a talent for killing gnomes all right so you're gonna get everything back up the first thing we need to do is we need to boost the crit 
we need to boot anything you want here attack or whatever and we need to boot this all the way uh, all the way up to five reduce the march ap consumed by one percent so you're gonna have this up to five percent which is the max anything here doesn't matter anymore so now we're gonna go to any of these i got my buildings all max so i go for um production and then anything here doesn't matter because you're gonna be killing a lot of normals but you want xp here i'm gonna get the what is this um load i'm gonna go for the gold all right here you don't care about anything of this but i'm gonna get this because it's more useful obviously here i'm gonna get the dragon probably just to have it on all right now here i'm gonna just get this double enchanting stone is very good because what you're gonna get what you're gonna be hitting with this talent you're gonna get double the gem as well and then here always going for training and the next one we're gonna go for a crit rate crit on the prey because i love this and then here we're going for the uh, warehouse storage all right the next one here we're gonna go for uh, reduce the time purification i think it's that one uh increase the top low we don't care oops sorry we don't care about this rewards obtaining from double the rewards this one is very important as well if you can use it but i'm killing too much too much bosses so i, I take this one and uh, you probably you will use this because in uh, double the rewards as well which is very very good uh also um uh this one only doubled the stones, the enchanted stone, but this one is the one who doubled the rewards you get from the uh, the gems where you're going to use it, okay? The next one is we're going to go for the, I'm going to go for the dragon because I want to have this in case I do my dragon, I just swap it. Here, we're going to go for this. I like uh, consume AP when you're killing uh, bosses. I really like this one. And then here is the one, reduce AP cost by 10%. When you're fighting gnomes army oops and it doesn't let me eee, so here is a two percent left and here is a one percent so the, here you really want to get that two percent there instead of getting a one percent here so we're gonna do it again real quick you really want to max this one first you want to get that ten percent because here is only five so we're gonna get that ten percent real quick let's put everything again this one experience we're gonna get the gold we get the gold here we're gonna get this here we're gonna get the um dragon because just in case i need to do any dragon i'm not doing dragon so far now i've got all the dragon i never use this so i'm gonna go for uh, iron here we go for training like i said here i love this because i always pray and I like i like the extra resources all right here you should use this but for me i'm killing so many bosses so i want this and here we want we want also the dragon upgrade because this one we don't want to use it more uh, uh, so often right here i want this if you need the shop refresh you probably use this but i'm killing so many bosses so i want this to receive ap and here we're gonna have this one fully max all right and then here you can even use dodge if you want but i'm going always for crit because i love crit here we go for attack and then here we're gonna put this all the way to four percent this is the max we can go hopefully when we go more up there we can get this one to five which is another one percent when we kill when you kill a lot of gnomes i believe it really matter so we're gonna now save it remember before we could kill, we could kill 70 so let's see what's different now we're gonna be able to kill 74 so it's gonna be four more only there is that that's only four more and it's supposed to be at 10 percent so as you can see no using anything you're gonna be able to kill 70 but it's gonna be 4900 to kill 70 having uh the everything on you're gonna be able to able to kill four more which is 74. the question is does it worth it to have uh this on only for four spending 200 gems to go and 200 gems to go back uh, um I'm, I'm not sure guys but for me i would say yes if you only gonna kill 50 gnomes or something like this um any small amount i will say it's not worth it better save your 400 gems into going and then going back at any time but if you're gonna kill if you're gonna kill a lot maybe 200 or 300 gnomes maybe this this uh this talent is gonna make you more more useful so for me i will use it as a, as, as it was a test but i will use it i already got a setup uh, next time I'm gonna be killing, killing gnomes, I'm gonna make sure that this is on because when I kill gnomes uh, in this event, I kill a lot. 
and also if you have the double reward event are you gonna be killing over 100 200 gnomes all day in three days you're gonna be saving at ap or not just saving ap you're gonna be killing more gnomes that you will you will kill not using this talent so let's put it this way every hundred you want to be killing maybe uh 15 more maybe 15 16 more ev uh, 15 more every hundred so if you kill 300 maybe you're gonna kill uh 45 more gnomes and um, if you if you don't mind spending those gems those gems which is 400 gems if you go i think it's really good it worth it you're gonna kill a little bit more gnomes than normal but it's not a big deal if you're only gonna kill five i mean five 20 30 40 or 50 gnomes it's gonna be maybe just two more or one more so it's only really if you're gonna kill a lot i repeat above 200 300 gnomes i will say yes it worth it so this is me first time trying it and uh, it's like as you can see as, as you guys see it's only four gnomes different from this talent um, from not having this talent but i believe before i had let me see this before i had uh no i didn't have nothing 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 of it yeah so yeah it's only four different only four gnomes different from 70 to 74 having 4900 ap it's only four different guys it's only really worth it if you're gonna be killing a lot if you're not gonna be killing a lot it doesn't really worth it all right as you can see i put all the all the talents that really uh, depreciate the talent the ap use and you saw it's only four so only worth if you kill a lot if you don't kill a lot save your gems keep doing as a normal so that's the test for today guys hope you guys found this video useful subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one peace out bye bye